friends, it's me. Oh, <laughs> it's the sun. Today we're checking out some people having a very bad day. Nothing like going down the stairs and just, oh no. Oh, the poor kid just started patting mommy on the head like, it's okay, it's gonna be fine. Isn't that what you do to me when I'm crying? It doesn't help, does it? That would honestly make me even more angry. She's just straightening her hair, girl, it is straight. You could stop, oh, was that fire? Hey, you literally set on fire. How did that even happen? Like, I saw a spark and then, whoo! Hey, at least she unplugged it before it burned her hair off. Her hair is so long and beautiful. You know, I would have freaked if I saw a spark. You'll be hearing from my lawyers. Oh my goodness, that sauce looks delicious. Um, how did this happen? You know why? It's because you were using three pots when you could have just made this with two. How the sauce end up on the stove. You know, it's okay. I don't like my pasta extra saucy anyway. And if the sauce was that good, I'd be scooping it right off the stove and into my mouth. Problem solved. Oh, is that when they flip the rice and it's gonna like come out of the pan upside down and it's gonna be like perfect? Pick it up. I wanna see what it look like. Okay, be gentle with it. Hey, the whole thing just burnt to a crisp. Yeah, at least you got that little spot right there. That's still all right. Maybe if you cut the burn part off, it'll be okay. You could still salvage it. Oh man, I have never been so disappointed in my life. It's not even my food. POV, your three-year-old is a little piece of poop. Oh, he just bonked her on the head. <gasps> I just yanked her lash off. Bro, that hurts. How did he know they come off? You mean mother wasn't born with long, luscious eyelashes? You could just rip them off? And he was quick with it too. Like he got a firm grasp and just pulled. <gasps> Actual pain. Those are a lot of plates. You sure you could carry this? Oh, in the trash. She didn't even get to pick it up before she could even pick it up. Also, why are you setting the plates over the trash bin? Do you not have a countertop for that? Uh, this is painful to watch. Imagine waiting 30 minutes for your food and then this happens. Sorry, you gotta remake everything. She's in a car wash and it starts flooding. Um, uh, how is it getting in there? Does her car just have a secret hole that we don't know about? Hey, at least you get an interior wash. Carpet shampooed at no extra cost. I've never seen this. Like, is it just going through the hood and just inside? Going through a car wash, I thought I was safe. The chances of drowning in your car during a car wash are low, but never zero. What is that, bubble gum? Oh, it was the shoe. The shoe melted on the exhaust pipe of the bike. It was sizzling hot. Done grilled your brand new shoes. From now on, I'll be riding on my feet in the air. The time I went to get my family ice cream and my father ordered his on a cone. So she had to hold the cone the entire drive. You rather let it melt all over your lap like some doo-doo droppings than like start licking it. You know, if you're getting it to go and you have a long drive home, like you can get a cone in a cup. She was dedicated. She was like, no, this cone is for father. I will not be licking it. I will hold it here and let it drip all over me for the next 25 minutes than me do anything about it. Like she just sat there and let that happen. I don't care whose ice cream is it. If I'm holding it and it starts dripping, I will be licking it. Okay. Hey, hey, that's my coat. This is where I would just like, <gasps> oh wait, you got, oh no. I was about to say these machines never mess up. Things have never gotten stuck for me. Like it got the drink, but like what happened there? Just exploded. Coca-Cola can unalived itself. Well, here you go. I even popped it open for ya. Open the door. Oh no. How do we leave? Right there. See you in a little oh. bit. And we're making the best out of this situation. You look at this and think we snowed in? No, no, no. Free freezer. Is that snow or is that the stairs? Hey, that's snow. Did y'all go to sleep with the door open? Cause everything is covered in snow. Um, how are we gonna shut the front door? I'm going back to sleep. I'm gonna take a wild guess and say you woke up in Antarctica. Oh. The face is right. You telling me her dog did this when she was gone. Look mom, look what I did. I did this for you. Do you like it? Did he think there was a bone buried in his bed? Dig it for hours. Oh wait, there was no bone. My bad. 
McDonald's haul. What did you get? Some nuggies? Oh, well, cheese. Share, what are those? It's raining nuggets, y'all. Or is it mozzie sticks? McDonald's got mozzie sticks? Why does it say cheese box? Date idea. Oops. You want a nugget? You're gonna have to reach in there. I'm not hungry anymore. <laughs> They were going on a plane and they literally picked a window seats away from each other so that they can both get a window and then neither of them got an actual window. This is so unlucky because there's like one or two seats on a plane that don't have an actual window or you get like half a window right there and it's like who gets to control that window? You or the person in front of you and then some lucky duck on the plane gets two windows. Design flaw. This is very painful to see. And drop their bag, their plate of spaghetti, their laptop. There is pasta sauce on their white shoes. Their socks all over their floor, their back. Ah, oh, what now? I'm gonna eat what I can off the floor. And then hopefully it will give me enough energy to try and clean this mess. She just realized her dress snapped halfway through her workday. Uh-oh, we'll be holding this. Nip slipping coming. Wait, what do you do in this situation? The strap broke. You're at work. This is where you gotta improvise. I've broken straps before. You can tie them. You can like just tie it. It's, it's not gonna look pretty. Would you rather look like a fool for the rest of the workday or flash everybody at the workplace for free? <laughs> Oh damn, those churros look good. Did he just snatch it? Oh, now they fighting over it. And hey, you cannot have any kind of food around seagulls. If it's in sight, I just might. I don't trust them. They don't even trust each other. Are they all be fighting over the churro? Can birds even have chocolate? I'm convinced these winged rats can eat anything and it'll only make them more powerful. Oh! <gasps> Did she fall on her face? That dog came running like, You know, usually they stop before running a person over. This dude knocked her like a bowling pin. Oh, I heard something slam, but I wasn't sure if it's her face or not. And he ran away like the little menace he is. Like, I was just trying to play. You're the one not being funny. Hey, that's a lot of boxes, bro. Be careful with that. You cruising a little too fast. Oh, <sighs> he really got off that like, uh-uh, I did my job. They said deliver it to the yellow line and that is exactly what I did. I'm going home. And at least it was in boxes and it doesn't look like anything broke. Enjoy my breakfast. Hey, you cracked three eggs, but only one of them looked good. But wait, it's stuck to the stove. Oh. Now the stove is gonna enjoy your breakfast. I can't tell you how much I hate an electric stove. Move! You could have been a little more gentle with it. Eggs will not tolerate aggression. I don't think this is a good way to cut bangs. You really trust somebody to do that? Just freehand it with a pair of craft scissors? Those are for paper. Oh no, this is, you messed up. I mean, they're not that bad. You can't really tell that they're crooked unless you, you pause the video. Just trim them up a little more. You'll be all right. I don't trust nobody cut my bangs but myself and I barely trust myself. It broke the first time. Why do you keep going, bro? He keeps going. Is this your last day on the job? Is this your way of telling them you wanna quit? They said, pour these four glasses of tea and you can leave. Uh, the boiling water broke the cup. You know, I'll just keep going. There's boiling water and broken glass all over the countertop. He fears nothing. I feel like I witnessed the execution. Just one after the other, dead. Did somebody get their bone stuck to their jaw? Ah, the bone is stuck? I would be so scared for my doggy. Can't you just like lift it up? It'll come out. How does it get stuck? I mean, anything can get stuck if you <laughs> shove it in hard enough. Doggy probably thinks, wait, no, this is fine. Now I always have bone with me. Everything will be okay. <laughs> Flight in two hours. Somebody ate their passport. What is that? I thought it was a unicorn for a second. Like, what is this majestic creature in your backyard? Oh, I'm sorry. I mean, what is this passport eater doing here? Watch their owner be making them these really fancy food bowls with like salmon oil and anchovies and fresh papaya. And they still want to eat the passport. Yeah, it's a little windy outside. It's just a little windy. Ooh, ain't that building about to collapse. So windy. I don't know if this is a hurricane, tornado incoming. Knock the roof straight off the building. This looks like a warehouse, but everybody looks like a baseball player. Why are there so many baseball players in here? Are they playing a game and suddenly there was a gush of wind? Hello, friends.
friends, it's me. Today we're checking out some people having a very bad day. Yeah, it's just one of those days. Take out the trash and just. <gasps> Every day is one of those days. Like she tried to take out the trash, ended up getting taken out by the trash. That was just so smooth. The way that she just flung it and then just nope. <laughs> Ragdoll physics. So she tried out one of these VR machines at the mall. Like, oh cool, I always wanted to try one of these. Oh, it moves. <gasps> Hey, this is a little too realistic. <laughs> I don't think that was supposed to happen. Like, she probably thought it was real cool at first. Like, whoa. And the whole thing just... And the VR couldn't handle real life. No one was hurt except the machine. If you're ever having a bad day, just be glad that you're not this guy. He parked on the roof of a building right before a snowstorm. And the snow just like covered his car. It looked like he tried to dig around it, but like it's stuck. He ain't getting out of there until all the snow melts. Also, why would you park like in the very corner of a building like that? Imagine going up there like where's my car? Where did it go? Covered in snow. This guy is panicking, trying to take out a napkin. And then somehow, napkin machine broke. And it all came out. I just wanted one napkin. I really gotta wipe my hands. Guys, hello, please help somebody. Take them, put them on the counter. Do I look like a napkin holder? Yes, yes you do. Ah! Ah! What is that? What is that? What is that? It's moving. Ah! No, they're real. They're actually real. I thought it was gonna be like a prank with like a fake bug. But no, they're Plenty of time to react. Thought the blankie would save him. You know, when you hide under a blankie, you're supposed to be safe. No, no, no. Not from Beetle. I don't like this one bit. My dad calling me to tell me that my grandpa just died while I'm in the McDonald's drive-thru. The McDonald's employee looking at me and saying, sorry for your McLoss. <laughs> no, he did not. Is that gonna be all? Uh, my grandpa just died. Sorry for your McLoss. Where yesterday's loss is today's sauce. So you thinking honey mustard? Barbecue? This is so bad. I brought this exciting rose gift for her. And then... Okay, but the way you were holding it, one hand something that requires two hands, does not end very well. When I feel it kind of looked like an egg. Bye bye. She might not have gotten the rose, but instead, here's a video of me breaking the rose. Equally as good a gift. Silly girl. The detergent is supposed to go in the washing machine and not on the ground. How did this even happen? Okay, but same, been there, done that. Whenever you spill something expensive, you have no choice but to like scoop it and put it back. Or you know what you could have done? If you got a lot of laundry to do, just like wipe the clothes up with it and then throw it in there. Big brain. In this household, we don't like to waste. When you throw a rager at grandma's house, hey, why would you do that? The whole floor just collapsed. Grandma, I, I didn't know we had a basement, but we do now. And you know you got way too many people over when the literal floor can't support you guys. The house was like, you know what, I'm a snitch. These are original mahogany floors from 1952, y'all can't be doing this. So they worked five days on this insane sculpture. Did a spin, oh no, oh no, oh no. It was so cool too, it was such a cool sculpture. But it's made of clay, and they haven't put it in the kiln yet, so it's still soft. Oh no, the guy's face. Ah! I am sad for you, that sucks. Grandma got violated. They put her under the covers. With a fan and had the dog fart. What did you feed him? Taco Bell? Or is he just farting on command? He's having a gassy day. Let's take advantage of this gas. Let it rip. Oh, and the fan is facing her, so it's gonna go. Ah! Uh, nothing like breathing in the spicy aroma of a shark. That's f holy sh. Oh my god, there's so many of them. This has gotta be in Australia. Oh, ah! I was like, there was a lot, but what is that? Mommy spider! Woo! Coming out to play! Don't be recording my babies without my permission. Yes ma'am, this is your house now. I'm leaving. I put coconut oil on my eyebrows and my cat licked my face raw while I slept. Oh! Okay, I don't know what it is about oils and pets, but whenever I put coconut oil on my legs, my dogs go crazy licking it all up like it's a snack. The cat couldn't get enough of the coconut oil, but cats, they got this spiky tongue. It's like sandpaper. Like, mmm, delicious coconut oil. Mmm, eyebrow licking good. Literally licked the skin off. You should probably go get that checked out. 
Yo, this is a sign to do a patch test before you try giving yourself freckles with henna. <gasps> she did it all over her face. Uh oh, that ain't gonna come off. Why is it red? I thought they were supposed to be like brown. Was she allergic? So if you didn't know, henna temporarily dyes your skin. You can also use it in your hair and you can make some dots on your face and have some temporary freckles with it. But some people get really bad reactions to henna. So I mean, if you're gonna try it, do a spot test first. Make sure you don't get any funny reactions because you ain't gonna be laughing when it does not wipe off. It's too bad this wasn't around Halloween. Oh, the perfect time to go out out at night with your face like this. Scare some children. <laughs> hey, wait, why is this smoking? Ah! There's sparks! Is that what happens when you turn the heater on? Is this what father warned us about? This is why we're not allowed to touch the thermostat. It's literally on fire. I just want to turn the heater on. Like, you want heat? I'll give you heat. You want some smoke too? No, I can't. Oh, they were closing the store, and she got stuck. Yeah, you got it. Under this. Can you help me? Can you help me instead of just saying you got it? <laughs> nah, I'm trying to get a sick TikTok out of it. Damn. You can squeeze on yeah. under. Can't you just like move it and lift yeah. it up? Oh. Well, I guess you do got it. I get some free cookies or something. Damn. Right. Free cookies. Oh, he don't even work there. Just found an employee stuck. Oh no! Pull your shirt down. Ah, it's scraping. Ah, I don't like this one bit. In nomine Patris et Filii et Spiritus Sancti. Oh, the cat opened all the drawers. It was all part of his master plan. In nomine Patris et Filii. I don't know how you could sit on your bed and let this happen. Like it was falling, like you don't even move your laptop or nothing. No, it's okay. I'm gonna let the cat learn its lesson the hard way with a big bonk. When you've had a long day and this was the last straw for you. Oh, you know what? I think I'ma just lay here. She was carrying two 12 packs of Diet Coke and just slipped. You know, if your kneecaps aren't ruined, the Diet Coke sure is. Oh man, the worst is when you actually grab something, when you're slipping and then you still end up falling. I'ma just lay here, crack a cold one open. Two my tears have tried. You gotta pee real bad. Go to the bathroom, lift up the toilet seat cover, and a snake! Oh, hell no. That's why you have a flush button, right? What if it doesn't go down? What is it doing in there? This is actually an issue you have to worry about in some places. A snake coming out of the toilet. What if it hides inside where you can't see it and then you sit down? And it's just like, ah! This happened to me, I ain't never using a toilet again. Hey, what's happening? What's going on? Why is the handle on the teapot melting? You are a teapot. Aren't you supposed to be for boiling water on the stove? You got one job and you could barely do it right. Also, I think the handle is supposed to sit on top, but hope you like your tea crispy. PSA, don't turn on all your grill burners on full blast when your grill won't turn on. She burned her hair off, her eyebrows, and the lashes. Okay, I will admit when my barbecue doesn't turn on, I will turn all of them on. And then it sometimes it just like blasts you with fire. Like you're entering Satan's lair. It is a dangerous game, but like, I don't know what else to do. I got drumsticks to grill. So this is surveillance camera footage of something very, very bizarre that happened in the back alley of a meat shop. So they're opening the truck and that is the meat hanging. The meat before they cut it. The vegan teacher's worst nightmare. So they're backing up the truck, right? And they're walking away. You gotta watch closely because nobody understands how this happened. Okay, stop right there. That's good. Nope, keep going, keep going, come on. You moving real slow, like what's going on? And then the truck just collapses! Like they bought it off Wish.com or something. It fell apart. Did somebody loosen a screw? How does a truck just, woo? How did it even happen? The great carcass crash 2022. And I bet the worst part is they still took the ones that fell on the ground, just give it a little rinsey rinse and sold it to somebody to make food out of. This dude went to his girlfriend's house for the first time to meet her family. She's an ex-girlfriend now. Goes up to introduce myself to her mom. Her mother was my therapist. Oh, 
I would have did a 180, turned around, walked out that door. Her mom knows more about you than you know about you. I can't even imagine a more awkward situation. I thought she was gonna be like your doctor or your teacher, but you are therapist? Now we know why she is the ex-girlfriend. Help, I gotta pee so bad I'm babysitting and I can't get this freaking baby lock off. They got baby locks on the toilet? Why, so the baby don't drown itself? What if the baby gotta go pee? I'm kidding, they got diapers for that. But like, what are they gonna do? Lift up the lid, jump right in, and drown? Has that happened? Because I think it has. It looks like you just press the button, right? Maybe you're not pressing it hard enough. If I can't get that off, I'm going in the sink. No shame. Oh, that looks fun. They're going down the slime. Wait, what's this guy doing? Oh! <laughs> what even happened? Oh, he was holding on to the ledge and just like, oh. Okay, you know what? Understandable. That one friend who comes to the pool and doesn't want to get wet still ends up getting wet. One way or another. Oh, you don't like girls that are tatted? Just one dot. That Take was just one roster. dot. Time to wipe it off. Oh, Take what happened? Officer. Is that even a real tattoo? Just one drop of ink did all that. You know that face? That's the face. I ain't never trying to DIY again. The saddest moment in my entire life. And the food delivery person comes by. Why is that sad? Oh, you got your order. Oh, why? He was like, hey, I am not responsible for this. Like, you took it. Took the bag. It is no longer in my possession. I am no longer responsible for it. At least the food is still in the container. Not so bad. It's okay. I'll still eat it. Making my $300 coffee. How is that $300 coffee? Unless you're gonna make a $300 mistake. Also, why is the heat still on? Turn it off. Oh my, you were asking for that. Like, turn the heat off. Why are you pouring it? A glass cup. It's not even on a flat surface. Also, this looked like Turkish coffee. You deserved everything that happened in this video. Hello friends, it's me. And today we're gonna be checking out some people having a very bad day. Um. just happened a second ago he was feeding the fish it's like somebody pulled the plug turned him off the way he just collapsed in there like <laughs> a second ago he was feeding the fishes and now he's swimming with them i see now the fish bumped him on the head very deadly guys we may have a slight issue here why didn't no one tell me black lipstick stands oh i thought that was a butt for a sec oh Oh, uh, I didn't even know black lipstick stains. So you mean you can't draw it all over your face and body? Why didn't anybody tell her? Mm? Girl, you cannot blame me. I did not know. Do not put black lipstick all over face and body. Thank you. Now I know. Master Chef who? with the egg on the ground before the egg could even solidify. This would be my villain origin story. This is how it all started. No, but for real, what happened? What happened to the person that was working out right next to him? He took off the weight of one side and then it just went like, ah! The weight fell. You see the person in the corner? There is clearly somebody in the corner doing sit-ups. Oh, but what if they got up at the perfect moment? Uh-oh, uh-oh, nah. That dude saw his end. This is how it ended. The next sit-up gonna put me in heaven. <laughs> POV, you'll never eat raspberries again. Did that spider just come out of his raspberry hidey hole? Y'all saw that! It just crawled out of there! Uh-uh, I just buy raspberries. I'm double washing them, triple washing them. Chicken inside the hole of every berry I eat. I don't trust fruit with holes. Daddy! What happened? Daddy! Where is daddy? What did daddy do? Oh, <laughs> oh my god. Daddy! Oh, oh. He's okay. He's okay. Calm down. He's a professional stuntman. Practically walks through walls for a living. No! What is that? What kind of drink is in that? Ah! It was warm! 
fine. I don't know if they put it in the freezer and then when they took it out, tried to open it, it exploded. Like literally exploded. That's scary. <laughs> I already saw it once. Second time. It's still gonna scare me. I'm gonna watch it again until it unscares me. I'm ready for it. Now that was an explosion. They even got the cameraman in the face. Y'all explain this. I got caught another dude's name. And this is what I get. She broke his TV. This is what I get <gasps> for being caught another dude's name. Wait, she called you another guy's name. And instead of you getting mad at her, she gonna play that Uno reverse card. No, I'm the one who's angry at myself for being stupid. Girl, you owe him another monitor. Why is she still in the room? <gasps> she broke his TV and his monitor. She took his monitor off his desk and flung it at the TV. What a monster. It's gotta take all the patience in the world to not <laughs> fling her. Like she just flung your monitor. Equal rights mean equal fights. Nah, but that is messed up. You know what? At least you have a valentine to bring all these nice gifts to. You know what I did on valentine's day? I had to pay my taxes. The IRS my valentine? <laughs> nah, all I do is take, take, take. I'll just order some. Ooh, that is a nice quesadilla. What do you mean? That looks delicious. Oh, it was like so perfectly crunchy. Like, dang, that looks good. You know, when it looks that good, just eat it off the floor. Doesn't matter. Three second rule, three minute rule. I don't care. Thanks to the girl who ran out in front of my car. I saved your life, but you killed my that? Diet Coke. Oh, I was like, what is that? Did somebody do multiple turns in your car? That's Diet Coke. It's the ice. It's the ice floating around in it. You know, at least the cup holder caught all of the liquid. <laughs> And it's just chilling inside there. Like a little brown carpool. A windy day outside. You know, it was like that today. Ah! Literally her bag ripped open and her stuff flew out. That's how windy it is. Hey, I thought it was windy where I live. Also, this might sound like common sense, but apparently common sense is not so common. I wore a dress today. It was windy. As soon as I step out the car to go to the restaurant, my skirt just went, whoo! I flashed everybody at that restaurant before even walking in. I'm surprised they still serve me. Things not to do. Don't squeeze the glue. My computer! <laughs> my computer! Calm down, it's just glue. For a hot second, I thought it was something else. <gasps> Wait for it to dry and then peel it off. Oh, how satisfying would that be? I swear to God, it says negative 49 I know. <laughs> what do I do? Well, I ain't paying that. Jeffrey Bezos, can you help me with this little problem? <laughs> nah, but for real though, where did this kind of debt come from? Did the United States just hand their debt to some random person? I don't want it anymore. You take it. Not my responsibility. This was not my pet. He just took our AirPods. <gasps> he munched on them. I thought he was gonna collect them and bring them to his master. Oh, it's the ultimate crime. You know, what if you trained a bird to do that? And then you just had them go out, collect free AirPods and bring them back to you. Hmm. But this idiot just took it. Started munching on it. Can I eat this? <laughs> he ain't got no ears. He can't hear it. <laughs> she was recording a TikTok. Body. What happened? Ouch. The way she just... Oh! Hey, because she was wearing socks. This is why they tell you not to run on slippery floor. Oh! Oh, my whole face hurt watching this. I hope she didn't break a tooth. I just wanted to record a TikTok. This girl got nailed at work. Whoa! <laughs> nailed, as in a nail. Straight to the neck. It's in there good. Ooh, it's like a piercing. Get it? A nail piercing her neck. I thought it was funny. I will not be taking this out. Mm -mm. At first, I thought this was Photoshop. Like they got crabs at the baggage claim. Somebody packed a suitcase full of crabs and they're alive. Hey, yo, this is a chance. This is a chance to escape. And he making it work for it. You telling me I can't bring a shampoo bottle. But somebody packed a suitcase full of crabs and that was okay. TSA mind their own business. When it's a cooler full of crabs. I'm not good at math, but this don't add up. Uh-oh. There's not supposed to be water on the stairs. It's flooding. So this was a subway station. You told me this is rainwater? Somebody didn't just like let loose the ocean? Open the floodgates. You know, at least there's no one there. Except the person recording who clearly planned this. <laughs> I'm so terrified of being in a subway or somewhere underground and it starts to flood. Kind of unreasonable because we don't have a subway where I live or much rain for that matter. It's like one of those things that could happen and like you'd be stuck downstairs in 
and somehow can't go up the stairs while water is coming down the stairs and then you're stuck in the subway and then you drown. You know, same vibe as when you're watching a movie and then they're stuck underwater and the water is like this high and then they gotta like <gasps> come up for their last breath before it goes up and like watch that whole scene. I cannot breathe until they get out. And I'm like, no, what would I do in that situation? Give up? Drown? Probably. Imagine going to work at a jewelry store and then having to untangle this. I don't even know where to start with this. That's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, twelve. That is at least five necklaces that you have to untangle. And I can't even untangle my wires. And you got people doing this with a necklace like throw, throw the whole thing away. Put it back in the melting pot. Make a new necklace out of it. This guy dropped a $40,000 pallet of glass on his first day at work. Hey, new guy, how about you move this $40,000 thing of glass? I've never done this before, but I'm sure I can. Two seconds later, I guess I can't. Oopsies. Don't worry, insurance will cover it. Okay, this has got to be the worst possible mess to clean up. Hundreds of bottles of olive oil fell off the shelf. Look how far it spread. And I don't know if you guys have tried to clean oil before, but it ain't it. Thinking about quitting your job, this is a good day to do it. That is more slippery than a banana peel. They picked up a bunch of buckets of paint with a forklift and it just dropped them. I didn't know the tops came off that easily. Almost all the paint buckets on the shelf are white. And if you want a certain color, you gotta take it up to the front. And they mix that color fresh, just for you. So I used my mask as an elastic while straightening my hair. Oh, <gasps> it's literally melted into her hair as she straightened. Uh-oh, girl, good thing I watched this because I thought about it because I'm like, oh, I don't have a hairband. Maybe I can use the elastic part of a mask. But I never thought like, I'm gonna put up my hair with a mask and then straighten it like, that's just funny business. I uh-oh. <laughs> yikes. Is that a snake? No way this can be real. There is no way this can be real. It is huge. It is massive. I don't even think there are snakes that big. And if there are, I am afraid. Unlock the new fear. Also, everybody in the background screaming about this, recording it. Why are you pointing? Why do you keep pointing? We know. We know. We see the snake. I see the snake. Like, what are you pointing at? The tail light. My boss is going to kill me. Oh, broke a car in half. Hey, I just came in here for an oil change. Who cut the truck in half? It's just like, <laughs> how did this even happen? Y'all didn't put the whole car up like this and just put the top up and the bottom just fell off. Whoopsie. So for their 20th birthday, they bought 60 donuts, brought them to work. Guess what? On the way to work, gets a COVID test. Has COVID. Well, guess I can't go to work. Guess I'm going to sit home alone, isolated, and eat these donuts for the next two weeks. It's a sign. No one at work deserved these donuts. Go on, go home. Treat yourself. Use the sound so your wall doesn't completely break. So they were just chilling in their room and their wall just decided to collapse. Like, no, I've had enough of supporting you and this household. Why don't you lay down and die? You know, you know what, I just might. Just started peeling, shedding its outermost layer. I would be afraid. She fell asleep on a People magazine. Is that a person? <laughs> She got a tattoo smack dab on her head. I didn't even know you could do temporary tattoos like that. By just sleeping, pressing your face on a magazine, you could just get a temporary tattoo just like that. It came out clean. Oh no, they were pouring cement and then it went all over this guy's car. Someone had a little accident from the leaky hole in the back. Did y'all realize that the cement trucks have buttholes? I wouldn't call it that. A cement hole, but it's in the back. So, but it's in the back. Why can't you call it a butthole? Because that is not politically correct.